Hey everyone, Dexneezing here. I am back in this uh, kind of like long play let's play uh, as I do my first impressions um, of Path of Exile. So far I've been loving the game, just hit the first town and I'm ready to uh, see what else is going to happen. Thank you as well for all the comments. Um, I appreciate all the help with uh, the hotkeys and the audio and everything like that, so thank you very much y'all. Alright, so so far here's my character, I'm just level 2. Um, I've got to go talk to Tarkley, so let's go find out uh, where he is. Looks like he's here. Cool, what do you give me? Jedi robes and crude. <laughs> oh, that's what I got. Okay, select skill gem, huh? All right, let's see what we got. Freezing. Fire. Lightning. Oh, I like lightning. Ooh. Arc of knives. That's kind of cool. Nine additional projectiles. That's cool. Ooh, what's this? Ooh. That's kind of nice. Yeah, I think I'm going to do uh, one of these two. So let's see. Six mana. Half a second. Six percent crit. Six mana. There's no cast time. Eh, let's try this one. What are you going to say? Yep, as corpse will want to do. Okay, what do you got to buy? So, huh. So, scrolls of wisdom are the currency, huh? That's interesting. I'll sell you my bow. Can I sell you my bow? Maybe I have to click sell. Sword nail. So, so far I just got armors here. It's kind of fun. Eh, I think I'll wait. I'll only get some other cool stuff. That's alright, let's see if I get some cool drops. Unless they got something cool here. 3 to 10. Ooh, 7 to 14. 4 to 10. These are two handed. That's one handed. That's one handed. I want to get rid of that. Get a sword. One handed sword. Or a dagger. Ooh. Whoa, 40% global crit chance. So it looks like the difference here is just the uh, the sockets. Now well, what kind of socket is that? Yellow? I guess they both have yellow. Alright, let's buy that. Thank you very much, dude. Sweet. And you can have that. And bow. Alright, now I gotta go find this uh, tidal island. I'm not sure where that is. Maybe it's over here. So far it's pretty fun. So used to uh, just grinding away at Diablo and never <laughs> It's kind of nice to not know what's happening.
Take a little swim. There you go, my feet are clean now. Looks like I've got some kind of a new effect around me. Something's building up. Oh, okay, so here we go. Default attack. Frostbite. So that's that new one that I just got. Viper Strike is that one. I don't really uh, use my middle mouse buttons. So I got a weird mouse. Why don't I try putting that over here somewhere? There we go. Now I got a skill bar. That's kind of cool. Oh wow! Look at that. Yeah, that's a cool attack. It's like driftwood wands are dropping like nothing. Oh yeah, I definitely like this. It's kind of interesting. When I was playing Neverwinter. I, I played as a rogue and it was one of the best rogues on the server. But it's just it's only one. You know, there was no AOE skills. It was very very difficult to do anything and, and hit more than one guy. But it's very high DPS for just one uh, one monster. So seeing the variety of skills, I was taking a look at the skill tree and some class builders and checking out the subreddit um, it, this is really kind of it's really exciting it's very very flexible you know you can kind of build your character how you want uh, you don't have to worry about um, you know if you're gonna you know be stuck with not having an AOE or just single target damage or whatever it is so uh, so far uh, I think this is very superior Nope, out of there. Nope, nope, nope. nope. Choo choo. I can get a little train going. I <laughs> wonder how many guys I can get mad at me. Everybody. Press complete. Oh, no time. Look at that. All right, so I've already been there. There's one thing I'll say it's got going for it. It's got some big old maps. Yeah. Kind of run over everywhere. What about here? Nothing but some kind of book. Oh. Okay.
Sweet. Last time I did physical chaos damage. Could do more, or I could add some dexterity. Let's do some more physical damage. Oh, it's gonna be good. It would be nice if there was some kind of directional marker or something. Maybe I'm too used to playing MMOs. Waypoint. Ooh, what's that do? Oh, that's kind of fun. That's good to know. A little fast travel system. That, that's a cool animation. Looks like the uh, guts of the guy come out. Some kind of soul or skeleton or something. The mud flats. Is that where I'm supposed to go? Oh, I got a bunch of junk. Skull fragments, driftwood wands, scepters. Oh, looks like and greaves. Oh, looks like just stuff to vendor. Ancient talismans possess monsters through ray class. Is that a skill? I don't know what that is. If you guys know what that is, do leave a comment for me so I can figure <laughs> out what that means. That'd be great. Some interesting monsters. That's something that's really cool about this too. It's like there's a there's a big variety of monsters I've already seen. It's not you know just the same thing. I mean there's obviously mobs, but each each of these zones is already starting to feel unique. The fetid pool. See, I don't know if that's where I'm supposed to go. Oh, what's this? Rosius Glyph. Find a use for the glyph in the mud flats. Okay. So this thing, so the map has little icons too, huh? Ooh, look at this dude. Coming break rib talisman. What is that? Six percent increased rarity of items. Done. Is this it? So you can only have one talisman. I guess these must be rings. What else do I got? Rosie, oh, that's the thing I gotta figure out. Who's the quality of an armor? Hmm. Well, let's go figure out what this Rosie Cliff does. So, the zombies are swimming. Okay. Now you could swim in there forever, buddy. Oh, and here's another row nest.
<laughs> Another one of those, huh? Yes. No. Twenty percent increased damage from that belt. Sweet. All right. You know what? Let's get rid of one of these. Change my gloves out. You know what? We just do that. There we go. Three sockets. Two sockets. See you later. All right, so that's a dead end. Oh, maybe not. You know, I wonder if this is that island I'm supposed to go to. Huh, so that's the cutoff for things. Okay. Quest location. Up oh, there we go. See, this is what I needed. I needed that. But, you know, I'm kind of having fun figuring out a use for this. Talisman or rune or whatever this thing is. Let's see if we can find it. Well, that was probably the luckiest level up I've ever had. Whew. All right. Iron ring. Take that. So it looks like I got a whole bunch of new stuff here. Let's see. 21 evasion rating or armor. So I guess evasion is I'm just dodging? It seems kind of be more of a roguey thing to do. Let's try it. Four to six. Whoa. Four to sixteen. Now that I'm at level five. Yeah, let's take it. What is energy shield four? Three, three. Oh, so getting some stuff. So this is something I get used to again, just having limited spots. I'm kind of one of those guys that takes everything. <laughs> I never know what I'm going to need, so I don't like to be limited inventory. Ooh, what's this? Another glyph wall. Find the glyphs. I didn't find all the glyphs? Well, at least now I know. I have two. Three strangely shaped objects, huh? Okay. Well, that's good to know. At least it's told me that. Okay. This is one thing I think is pretty cool about this game is the flask system. So it kind of eliminates the annoyingness of having to always buy more mana potions or health potions or whatever. You know, just kill some monsters and you got some more. I mean, that, that, that's, I've never seen that in a game before and I really, I thought that was a good one. So, nice job developers. 
All right. The cave is open. Talk to Tarkley. Oh, of course, and some crazy dude is coming here. All right. Woo! Oh, that was worth it. Scare me. That sounds fun. Skinning knife. Driftwood scepter. Be nice if there was a organize button or something here. These don't seem to be anything. Rusted hatchet. There we go. I would like to identify that item. Whoa! Why is elemental damage in red? Oh, and life gain on kill. I like that. very much. Now that is the easiest thing I've ever seen to get rid of these sockets. You just right click it. And never winner, you'd have to pay gold every time you switch something out. Yeah, that's nice. Alright. So Is there a way to get to that fast travel screen again? You. Can I click it? No fast travel, huh? Maybe I'm not looking right. If you guys know the fast travel way, please let me know. Um, that'll be great. Instead of having to run all the way back to town. So far, let's uh, let's see what happens. What's up here? Well, this is a fun video. Thank you guys so much. Uh, I really appreciate all the comments, and the likes, and subscribes. Uh, please keep them coming, and let me know what else you guys want to see in the next video. Uh, I will go back and get my reward and keep trying to find this elusive tidal island. Thank